our academic collaborative center, we want to contribute to better healthcare by improving supply chains and networks, by learning from the fast quantitative data which are produced in healthcare almost every day, and we want to improve the societal impact of legislation and oversight. We primarily focus on hospitals and general practitioner care. My mission is to understand how legislation works in healthcare. I'm not a lawyer, I'm a social scientist. We learned that legislation always affects people, but very often in surprising ways. Let me give you an example. Legislation on complaints procedures is meant to support the resolution of those complaints. But we found that form formal procedures rarely provide that resolution. If you want to learn more, feel free to get in touch with me. In our academic collaborative center, I focus on everything that's unusual. Uh, you know, from uh, uncommon adverse events uh, for experimental treatments to uh, the recognition of rare diseases um, by non-expert healthcare professionals. And I use two approaches that I think uh, are very different but complementary. That's uh, qualitative research on the organization and quality of healthcare and uh, quantitative research, uh, which is used for uh, automated recognition of um, rare instances of recognizing the unusual. So if you want to participate in this uh, interdisciplinary research where you can combine uh, innovative and uh, conventional approaches, contact me and we'll see where uh, you can join us. Today's healthcare system generates an ever-increasing amount of data. Electronic health records, claims data, health apps, everything generates data. The question now is, how can we use this data to improve the care for patients and to enhance transparency in health care? And what is the citizen's role and the patient's role in providing data? How can patients and professionals learn from this data? This is not a, just about machine learning and artificial intelligence and algorithms. It's about data quality, it's about access to data, feedback loops, decision support. It's about learning from the data and it's about trust in data. And if you want to do research there, this is a mix of big data science and social science. And if students are interested in this new and exciting multidisciplinary field of study, they really should get in touch. For each patient, coherence is a must. Now think of the treatment of a complex disease, for instance, cancer. The treatment is then divided into multiple steps. And each step, in turn, needs input from different professionals or organizations with specific expertise. This diversity often leads to badly connected or even missing links. Using knowledge from the field of operations management, I try to better align the steps in the treatment. Of course, with room for individual preferences of the patient. In this research, I try to join forces and collaborate with healthcare experts. Music